Right, well, um, <coughs> this is just a quick little instructional video for um, uh, some people that I've seen um, asking a lot of questions about how to put um, chapters into a, a video. Uh, for some people, they're just not quite grasping how it works. So, so I'm just. This is just like I say, a quick uh, tutorial to show you um, to show you how this works, and uh, hopefully um, you'll get the uh, the idea of how it works. So anyway. Um, uh, the first thing we're going to do is uh, I'm just going to uh, I'm going to show you um, one of my videos. Just give you an example. Yeah, I'll just give you an example of one of my videos, which has some chapters in. Uh, which one is it? Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. It's this one here. Okay, so if I uh, view this on uh, YouTube, uh, let me just mute that uh, so we don't get to any uh, copyright claims. Hopefully, skip that. Yeah, so um, so what you might have seen is um, <coughs> let me um, see if I can make this uh, full screen here. So if I just scroll down, you'll see down at the bottom here. You see these sections, and when I hover over them, it it, it shows up like like a section or what some people call a, a chapter. Okay, um, and these are great if you want to jump to a specific point in a video or if you want to highlight something in a video. Um, they're great for that. Um, so as you can see here I've got uh, I've got the title of uh, of the video and that it's a long term project and I've got what you need section and uh, life from day one so so we're just highlighting little sections of the video here uh, there might be something specific that somebody's looking for and and using these chapters they can find that uh, that item uh, you'll see down in my um, in my video description here that I've got the um, I've got the timestamps listed um, in the video description, and that's really as as simple as it as it could be, to be perfectly honest with you. So uh, let me minimise that back down again. Um, so yeah, so what you do is you take your video. So go to your uh, YouTube studio and you go to your channel videos, um, and then you select your video. So um, I was on which one was it now? Then there it is. <coughs> and then here in your when you're um, uploading your video in your description box or you can edit it afterwards after you've uploaded it of course obviously um, this is the the place where you add the timestamps in and it literally is just a case of adding zero colon zero zero and the title now um, you have to include zero colon zero zero as your first timestamp that has to be included okay um, if that's not included it won't work all right um, so uh, so that always has to be there uh, and that's like I said that's a great place to put the title of your video uh, and then further timestamps well 11 seconds in I've got my what you need timestamp 43 seconds in I've got my life from day one timestamp and it's literally that easy it's 0 colon 43 1 minute 0 uh, colon 0 09 a flatworm and so on and so forth for as many as many chapters as you want to uh, to place into your video um, and it's it's really that simple now um, it's worth pointing out that uh, I'm working on a desktop here I'm not sure exactly how it works on mobiles uh, I would imagine it's the same okay I don't use a mobile for editing and uploading um, I just use a desktop PC so um, like I say that being said um, it really is that simple but the main point is to include zero colon zero zero okay um, that has to be there otherwise it will not work um, even if you put that as zero colon zero one it won't work you have to have all zeros for your first timestamp okay and uh, it's really that simple um, I hope that's of use to somebody out there and uh, yeah give me a thumbs up uh, always appreciated and uh, I will see you on the next one. All right, bye for now.